When it comes to the issue of abortion, there is a clear divide between Kendra Horn and Mark Wayne Mullen. Horn, the Democrat, is pro-choice but believes there should be some limitations. Mullen, the Republican, is pro-life and is open to a nationwide ban. And it is government overreach, plain and simple. Uh, and in the wake of the, the Dobbs decision overturning Roe this summer, uh, it has put us at risk as Oklahomans and not just women. Former Congresswoman and Democratic nominee for U.S. Senate Kendra Horn says because of the abortion ban that now exists in Oklahoma, individual health, doctors, and the state's economic future are being threatened. Congressman Mark Wayne Mullen and the Republican nominee in this race has a different so take. My goal is to save every child out there. I, I, I think the Lord that we're saving our, our kids, children here inside Oklahoma, but children in California and children in Massachusetts are just as important as the children here in Oklahoma. So should the federal government weigh in? Senator Lindsey Graham of South Carolina has already introduced a 15-week federal ban. Mullen says he has not reviewed that specific legislation, but not opposed to it either. We should be fighting for every kid to have the right to life. And uh, and so if uh, if that's what we can do, then absolutely. Horn opposed to any sort of blanket ban, but also believes there needs to be some limit on when abortion should be available to people who are pregnant. You know, Horn referencing national polling from groups like Pew Research. Um, most Americans and most Oklahomans support uh, some form of access up until about uh, 20 weeks, 17 to 20 weeks. And I think that the conversation should exist in that space. Horn also said she supports the Rose Standard, which is a cut off at 24 weeks. Oklahoma remains among a handful of states that only allows abortion if the mother's life is at risk.